Is one-on-one -on -one something that, you know, let's say contract legalities aside, should be an event at All-Star Weekend? Yes, but I, I, I think you got too many guys that want to protect their brand. Right. And be afraid to go and play on one-on-one -on -one because maybe they get embarrassed. And if you face somebody like a Kyrie, oh, Lord, you're going to be shaking in your boots. So um, <laughs> I don't think and, – and it's crazy because, I mean, you you got to be a confident player to play in the NBA. But when you take away somebody that can help them, they're not as confident. So, I, yeah, I, I, I don't see – uh, all the guys getting into a one-on-one -on -one battle. The, the elite guys. Harry, yes. He's not afraid of anything. But some of the other guys, I don't think so. They will look at the roster and find out, okay, who's in it? Oh, Harry? Mm -mm. That's like <laughs> that's like me getting into the slam dunk contest with Vince. Like, come on, bro. I, I know what you could do. Why the hell I'm going to get in there and just to play second or third? I don't want to compete against like I, I'm not, yeah. I don't, but I don't have the hops and the creativity as you. So it, it'd be that same situation. Is that why you think guys aren't competing in any of the all-star weekend events these days? It, it's either that or, you know, maybe they want some extra bucks or they want to take advantage of it being a break. <laughs>